what's up welcome back to my channel if you're new then welcome as you can see I've got good lighting I'm hands-free because I finally got a tripod you may have seen in my fish tank cleaning video that I was supposed to have my tripod and it didn't get delivered I had to go pick it up from a UPS access point but now I have it and my videos are about to get so much easier to film I am so excited so far I'm loving this tripod, it is amazing. Okay, back to the video. So I said on Twitter a little while ago that I really wanted to do an Amazon Reptile haul video. But being the broke college student that I am, I couldn't just order a massive amount of things. Every couple of weeks or every paycheck I'd order one or two things. So now I think I finally have a good amount of things that I've ordered from Amazon. So I'm going to do a Amazon reptile haul video. And just so you guys know, I will be putting Amazon links for each item in the description below so you guys can go shopping. So I guess first off we can add this lovely tripod because this helped me film my reptile YouTube videos. So shout out to Saborvo. It's Saborvo. NT368. Alright, so you might see me looking at my phone a little bit in this video, but that's because I'm on Amazon so I can tell you how much I paid for everything and whether it was Prime or not. And then I'm pretty sure everything I got was Prime. I won't buy anything if it's not Prime because I'm very impatient and I hate waiting for things to ship. First up is one of my favorite products. You guys hear me talk about it in every iguana video. The world's best UV people. The Mega Ray. So the Mega Rays are a mercury vapor bulb. So it's heat, UVB, UVA, all combined into one. So this one that I have is the 100 watt. That is what I'm using in Arcadius's enclosure right now. You see it up there where it's very, very bright. So that is what he has. So that's his basking spot. What I really like about these is on the side of the box, it actually has like a diagram that tells you the basking range for all the different wattages and like the distance of where your reptile is compared to the bulb. I wish more UVBs had this, but for example, this is 100 watt. So you have your wattages and then you have the distance in inches and then you have the distance in UVB output. So if you look up your animal and what their UVB requirement is, then you can kind of see where they fall and the distance that they need to be, or the minimum distance. So it's very, very helpful. And they also tell you the UVB intensity and all that good stuff. So the makers provide you with a lot of information. And if you have questions, you can call them the first time we ordered one. We called them and he answered every question we had about UVBs for iguanas. Like they're super knowledgeable and just super super great. So it was Amazon Prime and I paid $43.90. So not too bad and you get Prime so you get it in two days. So I highly recommend. Um, I haven't had a problem with either of mine, it's the second time that I've ordered it from Amazon and both times they've come in working great so five star for me so next up on my list you guys saw in my room tour video and that is this sign this is my favorite thing ever I saw an Amazon and I had to get it it hangs on my door to my room it's just super funny because Arcadius is like the sweetest iguana ever doesn't have a mean bone in his body. So I just thought it was really funny. And it was Amazon Prime and I paid $9.95. So not really anything to do with reptile care, but it was reptile related so I wanted to include it. So the next thing I got was my thermostat for my Rainbow Boas heat mat. And this heat mat is from Century. So far I like it and I haven't had any problems with it. So this is the box and that is actually exactly what it looks like. It's hooked up right now so I don't have it to show you but I have the box. 
and I paid $18.99 and it was Amazon Prime. So it was one of the cheaper ones but it still had good reviews and it works very well. Alright, up next is something I actually got maybe last week because of my rainbow boa and I wanted to make sure the temperatures were completely accurate because he's so young and I wanted to make sure everything was right. So it is my temperature gun. I've been wanting one of these for a while because my parents have one and I'd use it at home for Arcadius when I first got him and I just feel like it's gotten to a point where this is something that like you, you need if you're a reptile keeper. So I got this one, it's from Newbie, I hope I'm saying that right. It's a newbie infrared thermometer and I did also keep the packaging because of this video. It's not in the packaging though so I guess this isn't that helpful. I really like this one because the screen does light up so if you're doing it in like a dark room or when it's dark out you can still see what it says and you can change it for Celsius, Fahrenheit. So this is what it looks like. It's got the buttons to change whether you want Fahrenheit or Celsius and then all these other buttons I don't remember what they do so this works pretty well I like it I was looking at the ones that a lot of other people have I don't know what company they are but they're like yellow and black it's the one that my parents have but the price was going all over on Amazon and then it got really high so I was like I don't really want to pay that much let's look and see what else there is so there was a lot that were fairly inexpensive and had good reviews, so it was just deciding on one. So I went with this one, and I paid $12.82 for it, and it was Prime. So just over $10, and it works really well. Alright, so the next thing that I got is this Fluker's Bend Branch. I think I got the medium one, so it's 6 foot. 6 foot. Wow that's it and I got it from my rainbow boa I wasn't originally planning on getting one but I went to a pet store last weekend and saw them and they were like six bucks so I was like hey that's kind of inexpensive like maybe I'll get it but let me look on Amazon first and they had it as an add-on for 323 like three dollars we're in a pet store this would be like a lot more so I got it and so I'll have to set it up in my rainbow boa and show you guys that eventually when I do it so the last thing I got came in today with my tripod and I'm not sure how I feel about it but it's a scale because I wanted to start keeping track of my animals weights especially my boa because he's a baby so I wanted to get a digital scale and I was stuck between a whole bunch they're all about the same price range same reviews so I just went with one not realizing it was a mini scale so I thought I was getting just like a normal kitchen scale that's what it looked like in the pictures that people posted in the reviews this is what came in today. This isn't even the size of my head. I'm holding it in one hand. So the size will work fine for my rainbow boa, but I'm pretty sure I will not be able to weigh Arcadius or my corn snake phoenix on this because I can't put a bucket big enough on top of this because it's so tiny. But it came with batteries so that was cool. It also came with this little tray that you can sit on top of it. And the screen is backlit. And it does do grams, so that's really cool. And it has a bunch of other things that you can mess with as a tear button. So, I mean, it's a good little scale. I haven't used it yet, but it's cute. And it's, I mean, for what it is, it's good. But it's not the size I was hoping for. But I paid $12.99 for it, and it was Amazon Prime. So it wasn't that expensive. I'll probably just go to Walmart and get a normal kitchen scale. But 
I might as well just keep this because if I have any tiny lizards or other baby snakes or anything in the future, then I'll have just a little scale that I can use. So I might as well just keep it. So that was the last thing that I got. Real quick, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more videos in the future. So lastly, if you guys have any favorite reptile products that you have bought on Amazon that I didn't mention, leave them in the comments below so I can go check them out, maybe add them to my shopping cart. So as always, thanks for watching, love you guys, and see you next time.